Next game on the board, we have got 12 p.m. Big Ten Network game, Michigan State, a five and a half point favorite at Rutgers, total of 51. Rutgers won last year 38 to 27, uh, but that version of Michigan State was completely different than this version. We have talked a lot about Kenneth Walker III. We've talked a lot about Michigan State and whatnot. And I bet against them last week. There was a chance for a backdoor cover there for me, and that's the whole reason why I bet Western Kentucky last week. I always knew that Michigan State was going to win the game, but this is this is a weird game for me because Rutgers has shown the ability with teams that are not explosive, they can drag you into the mud, right? The way that they play on offense and on defense, if they drag you into the mud and they pull out one of those trick plays that Sean Gleason likes to do, it can totally flip a game around. And I worry about this one because I think that their defense is actually pretty good. Their front seven on defense can stop the run. I think they're going to slow up Kenneth Walker the third, excuse me, a little bit. I, I'm going to take Rutgers plus the five and a half here to be able to cover at home. I think Michigan State wins this game because I think overall team strength, they're just better. They'll find a way to, to win this by a field goal or something. But, I mean, I could absolutely see a 21-17 to 17 kind of game with, uh, with Rutgers covering but not being able to win. Yeah, I like this game to be low scoring. I, I, I like this Rutgers team. You know that. I, I like Craig Shiano. I think he's a good football coach. And, and what he, what he's able to do at this bad, bad program historically it, it has been remarkable. I think I'm going to take Michigan State here. And here's my reasons why. I, I trust teams that play good defense, that can run the football, that don't turn the ball over and don't get penalized heavily to be able to go on the road and do those things consistently. that So when they're better than somebody, they should beat them and they should cover because they they aren't going to give you an opportunity to make a mistake and then beat themselves. They're just not going to do it. Yeah, I can I can totally see that. I can totally see that. And they, I'll tell you, that Nebraska game terrified me with Michigan State, right? You know, we'll see what happens. That's, that's the fun part about betting on games early in the season is – you're still trying to figure them out. I mean, we're we're into week six now. We feel like we know Michigan State. By the way, they've already gone over their win total on the season, five and, and, and their win total was four and a half. So cheers to that part. But we are getting into a little meatier part of the schedule, uh, if I do say so myself. So we're uh, I'm taking Rutgers plus five and a half. You've got Michigan State minus five and a half. Thanks for listening to the Winning Cures Everything podcast. The website is winningcureseverything.com, and if you want to connect with us, we're on Twitter, at GaryWCE, at ChrisBGiannini, at Winning Cures, or you can email us, Gary at winningcureseverything.com, or Chris at winningcureseverything.com. Subscribe everywhere you need to subscribe, and we'll see you soon.